Hi church, happy Friday. I want to offer you a poem today by Denise Levertoff. It's one of my favorites and it's called To Live in the Mercy of God. It goes like this. To lie back under the tallest, oldest trees, how far the stems rise, rise before ribs of shelter are open. To live in the mercy of God, the complete sentence too adequate has no give. Awe, not comfort. Stone, elbows of stony wood beneath lenient moss bed. And awe suddenly passing beyond itself becomes a form of comfort, becomes the steady air you glide on, arms stretched like the wings of flying foxes, to hear the multiple silence of trees, the rainy forest depths of their listening, to float upheld as salt water would hold you once you dared to live in the mercy of God, to feel vibrate the enraptured waterfall flinging itself unabating down and down to clenched fists of rock, swiftness of plunge, hour after year after century, oh or ah, uninterrupted, voice many stranded, to breathe spray the smoke of it, arcs of steel white foam, glissades of fugitive jade barely perceptible, such passion, rage or joy, Thus not mild, not temperate, God's love for the world, vast flood of mercy flung on resistance. Denise Liebertoff wrote this poem in 1996, and you can find it in her book, Sands from the Well. Sands from the Well. Um, I found it on the Poetry Foundation's website. When I was in the midst of a health crisis, I returned to this poem many times, especially to this image uh, of faith that it had, which was to float upheld as salt water would hold you once you dared. For me, trust in that very uncertain season was all about imagining myself floating upheld as salt water would hold you once you dared. It's that letting go in the salt water and noticing, wow, you really can float. And I imagine that there is need for us in this season to have moments of letting go. It's hard to do in the midst of the stress and the anxiety of the season. And yet we know God is with us in the season. God is providing for us. And that no matter what troubles we face, God will be right beside us facing those troubles with us. Um, and so I encourage you to consider are you floating upheld as salt water would hold you once you dared? Have a good weekend.